Welcome back, Mr. Lionel Blair. Thank you. To the Big Brothers Bit on the Side studio. No, it, right if here. you're going to call me by yeah. my name, mm -hmm. you must call me what Dappy calls me. Lord Lionel Blair, the first 1ST. Wow, well, <laughs> Mr. Lord Lionel Blair, the first 1ST. Yes. Welcome back. And uh, now, it was apparent in the house that um, your dancing skills came out on the odd occasion. Yes. And a one, two, three. Big smile. Hey! Big smile! Two. Oh, big smile! A one, two, three, jazz hand! Uh, so we thought it would be apt if uh, you taught me some dancing skills. All right. And we also talked about your time in the house. Yeah? All right. A no. One, two, three. Yeah. A one, two, three. Together. One, two, three. It's fair to say that the first thing in uh, tap dancing or dancing in general, I'd say, is balance. Balance, is, is, absolutely. Is, is important. And shape. And shape. Yeah. So, uh, when when you're in a house with eleven people, like uh, when it came to balance, how difficult was it, kind of uh, being balanced in there as a person? Oh, it was quite easy actually. They often asked me to teach them a routine, like you did. Yeah. Or when we were outside, there was the green bit in the middle and the stone steps mm. round. Mm. Do you have a dog? I do. Actually. Do you walk your dog? I love walking. Now, my dog. when you walk your dog, instead of walking it like that. Put your shoulders back yeah. and just walk, walk, walk. But in terms of in the house, yes. how was how was it uh, maintaining balance as a person within as with the other house? Very difficult like, sometimes. Yeah? Yes. Why was for that? For certain people, to keep a, a balanced mind, you had to bite your lip occasionally. Uh, I didn't want to upset anybody because mm. I don't like confrontation. Yeah. So you zip. Zip it. Zip it. One, two, three. Swing Good. your arms. One, two, three. Have I got One. it? Now, routine, making up a routine, yes. very important in dance. Absolutely. Um, in the house, though, mm. how difficult was it maintaining your daily routine? Well, I used to get up, mm. throw the covers off. Louisa yeah. used to get up and make prosciutto, little toast with garlic and oh. basil, yeah. put my dressing gown. Oh! Put my microphone on first. Of course. Always do that. Mm, exactly. Then I made a cup of coffee. Then you went back into the bedroom. Mm. I'd go outside and have a cigarette. Make your bed. Then go and shave, shower, esh, and um, sleep. <laughs> <laughs> really? So there was a lot of routine. And, yes. and did that help you get through the day, basically? Oh, yeah, routine? sure. Yeah. If you're sitting thinking you're doing nothing, oh, I haven't made the bed. You go make the make bed. Make the bed. You show. Thank you, show. Check <laughs> this out. How do you like that? I like that. Showmanship. Yes, very important. Really important. Yes. Now, in the house, uh, was this something you consciously thought about, you know, being a showmanship, to be Absolutely. entertaining? Absolutely. I tried to put on something different every single day. Every day. If it was a sweater, a shirt or something, mm. and put it with something else. But when you go to work and you love your work, yeah. you don't come dressed like that. No. You put what, a, like this? And, yeah, exactly oh, like that. Oh, this? That. Well, it's all this right. This is my cool it, it, hipster. Oh, yeah. How old are you? I'm saying 26. Yeah, well, it's time you started. <laughs> you, you, listen. Yeah. I have a proverb. Yeah. If you look good, you perform good. That is a good proverb. One, two, three, jazz out. Thanks very much for teaching me You're the welcome. general rules of, of You're tap very dancing. Well. I could teach Daffy, I could teach anybody. Exactly. And since you were so great in the over 18s, now you taught me tap dancing, let's talk lap dancing. Lap dancing. Yeah. yeah.